Median, 400 meter icon, Kirani James, and Antigua's Sir Quietly Ambrose to receive UWI honorary doctorate. Viewers and subscribers, welcome, welcome back to another video. You know, it's a boy SAE, big up on yourself, and um, thank you all for tuning into this one. So, people, we're getting a little news out of Antigua or the West Indies University where we are seeing that decorated um Grenadian quarter miler um Kirani James and West Indies cricket legend Sir Quotely Ambrose are said to be honored with honorary doctorate degrees from the uni from the university people of West Indies UWI according to reports you understand they are among 13 Distinguished individuals um, recognized for, the, for their outstanding contribution to the Caribbean region with ceremonies scheduled across UWI's five campuses from October 12th to November 9th. And, and, to and to talk a little bit about Quotely Ambrose and Kiani, Kirani James, guys, without even going into the details of what they publish, we are, it's self explanatory. It's self explanatory, people, because we know Quotely Ambrose, a huge servant or a big servant of West Indies Creed. This man is legendary. This man created history for West Indies while representing them. This man holds test records. You know, people, he has helped a lot of youngsters around the Caribbean. You know, we just recently heard him saying that he's looking to really um guide Joel Andrew. Um, so you understand it. Alzari Joseph look up to him. So you understand, people, this man has done a lot. And if it and to touch on Kirani James. From when I was a kid growing up, I used to see Kiani James run, you know, and he always got medal. And enough of the time he got medal for Grenada when nobody else was got in, you know, he really put Grenada on the map, you know. So them receiving doctorate guys from the university is something that um they deserve. You understand? They have really been a servant to the Caribbean people, you know. Um but um Kirani James, you know, um Renowned as one of the most accomplished 400 meter runners in history, will receive the honorary degree of Doctor of Law LLD. You know, James, who made history as Grenada's first Olympic medalist, has consistently excelled on the global stage. He is one of only nine athletes ever to win world titles at the youth, junior, and senior levels, and is the first athlete to secure three individual olympic medals in the the 400 meter with gold in 2012 silver in 2016 and bronze in 2020 james also boosted three world championship medal including gold in 2011 so you understand when i say they deserve it people they really deserve what they have been getting right now you know they have really been a big servant to West Indies cricket guys we more than we can really you know imagine because these guys step out and break the boundaries you understand in terms of putting their country on the map producing great players and they were in the batch at really um set the foundation you understand beyond his illustrious um athletic career James has demonstrated a commitment to educate and community um development he, uh, he holds a bachelor's degree in general business and serves on the board of director of the Windward Island Research and Education Foundation. People where he contributes to the sport for health program. His recognition by his UWI not only celebrates his athletic achievements but also knowledge. Um, his broad contribution to Grenada, our Grenadian um, society, and the Caribbean region. You know, joining James people, you know, um, the honors or the honorary um, is Sir Courtly Ambrose, the legendary fast bowler from Antigua and Barbuda, who will also be conferred with. An honorary doctor of law's degree, Ambrose, one of cricket's all-time greats, terrorized a batman 
worldwide during his career, helping to cement the West Indies' dominance in the sport during the late 1980s and 1990s. His remarkable impact and cricket has left a lasting legacy, making him a fitting recipient of his distinguished recognition. And I believe that they should have given him that long, long time ago, people, because this man has really, you know, people, this man is a legend, people. And I believe from a long time they should have awarded him that um, honor in the country, doctorate of law. People, congratulations to them. Congratulations to them. These guys really deserve anything that they are getting now, people. They have really um, contributed a lot to their small islands. You understand? It In its official um, statement, UWI emphasized um, the importance of celebrating individuals who have made significant contribution to various fields, including sports, culture, medicine, and human rights. This year's recipient of excel in advocacy medicine tourism culture sports business education science and music uwi stated highlighting um the ad the diverse of diverse achievement of those being honored so you know it's good thing that you know they are really taking the opportunity to to really um honor them recently year guys um i think the 27th of september will be um Julian Alfred, I think she's St. Lucian sprinter, reigning 100 meter champion, and she just won a Diamond League goal as well. Um, she will be awarded, I think 27th of September will be her national holiday because she's the first female sprinter or the first sprinter from St. Lucia to bring goal back to their homeland. You know, people, they said St. Lucia is a tiny island, but I've never been there before and we can see it on map, but one day we shall go there. But as you know, we, the Caribbean people, we rise from nothing and we go out there and we produce the best produce to the best of our ability and really um go out there and show the world that we look about we tell our similar to jamaica you know we are dominant we are known as one of the powerhouse in sprinting but we 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 we, we, we people we, we are just different we produce sprinters pan type of sprinters you know when people feel like the jamaican sprinting is done we just succumb you know similar to cricketers we produce chris gale russell powell Hines, um a lot of cricketers guys even before who I can remember a lot of them, but the UWI graduation ceremony will take place across um, its campuses in Antigua, Barbados, Trinidad, and Tobago, um, Jamaica, and globally via the UWI Open Campus, each m marking the contribution of the honorees in their respective fields. James' recognition will take place on November 9th, and Bruce will be honored and the Five Islands Campus Ceremony in, in Antigua on October 12th. So as we know, all of the Caribbean have a campus, um, UWI, but you know, we are all connected, but big demo people, little more. Leave your thoughts in the comment section.